Steve here with Table Rock Tea Company. We're back in the greenhouse, as I told you we would be in here a lot this year. And in particular, we're back in the germination room. I want to show you a couple of particular things about tea seeds. Uh, first of all, tea starts to produce seeds that drop in November, December, something like that. And typically, they don't start germinating out until May, April, May, something like that. Really long germination rate. However, here in the greenhouse and in South Carolina, we had an unusual um, temperature snap. Tea seeds will germinate between, well, above 56 degrees Fahrenheit. That's when they start to wake up. We went through a, uh, a snap here of warm weather. We're in the greenhouse. It got to be pretty toasty for a good long time, and it woke them up. That's a problem for me because we start planting uh, in March, and that's when we have to clear out the greenhouse. If you take a look over here, all those plants that are still here in the greenhouse, that's where the new seedlings have to go. I don't have anywhere to put them, so I am trying to artificially slow down the germination a little bit. Did that in a couple of ways. We started uh, opening all the vents on the greenhouse. We uh, took some of the bins out uh, to chill them a little bit. You can store seeds in a wine chiller. You just have to make sure you keep them between freezing, so 32 and 56. That's the sweet spot because freezing, it'll hurt them, and then 56, they'll start to germinate. So I wanted to show you what it looks like when they start germinating. Let me show you first a bin that was uh, started in January, maybe more appropriate, okay? You can see that there is nothing there, okay? Those little specks that you see that look green, that's not really, that's just a little bit of moss on the dirt. Um, but nice and flat, smooth, moist, all that good stuff. However, come on up here, and what you're going to find is a whole different story. Ba -ba -ba. That is a bin that is starting to germinate. So here's the interesting part, okay? You can see all these seedlings are coming up. These are all little tea seedlings, but I'll try to zoom in here. Can you see how the ground is rippling, okay? So it's like this entire crust is about to explode with seedlings. There are about a thousand at least in each bin. So these have already started to shoot out. We've got, uh, it looks like we've got about eight or so of them like that. Um, and so just so you know, if you want to, we are selling, uh, we do sell germinated bins. We do this every year. So this is not something new. Uh, this is something that we do every year. They're a bit expensive. Uh, it's $3,000 a bin. However, you're going to get a thousand already germinated tea seedlings from that. So it ends up working out to be three bucks or less per plant. So that's really a good deal. Um, you have to greenhouse them, overwinter them, and all that kind of stuff, but you can manage uh, the care of those. But at least you don't have to worry about whether or not your seeds are viable or whatever. So if you want a germinated bin like that, dun, 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 we have probably two or maybe three uh, left this year. We've already had some customers take some. So anyway, that's uh, what we're looking forward to. Uh, it looks like we'll be transplanting a little bit early this year. So watch that Facebook page for volunteer days and all that. It's always fun uh, to do the transplanting and, and uh, that's always a good time for volunteering. So thanks again for watching. Stay tuned to see what else is brewing here at Table Rock Tea Company.